And on the last corner to today, we're going to be watching Is Nicki Minaj the Queen of Rap? And this is by, I'm just saying, please, um, the original video will be in the description box below. And please show some support to, um, to, um, I'm just saying. And yeah, let's see you. Why she questioned Nicki Minaj. Rose is a red. Nicki Minaj is the queen of rap. Hey there. In this video, we are going to talk about why Nicki is queen of rap and why the other girlies in the game are not. <laughs> Number one, her songs. If you dislike Nicki Minaj, then that's okay. But you can't deny she has some of the most iconic songs and is featured on some of the most iconic songs. Would you like to hear me rap a Nicki Minaj verse a cappella? Um, no, I wouldn't really like a robot to do that. Bitch, it's King Kong. Yes, oh it's King God. Kong, bitch, it's King Kong. This is King Kong, Chinese ink on Siamese links on call me two chains name go ding dong, bitch, it's King Kong. Yes, I'm King Kong, this is King Kong. Yes, Miss King Kong, in my kingdom, with my Tims on. How many Champions. championships, what six rings on? Um... No. Number two, her flow, delivery, and lyrics. Nikki is a very talented woman, if yes. not one of the most talented women in the industry. When I want to listen to any rapper, I need them to have bars and a clear voice so I can hear what they are saying. Yeah. When I hear Nikki rap, I don't hear the spit from her mouth and I don't hear her stuttering. I hear her clearly pronouncing the words, even when she's rapping mega fast. Also, when I'm listening to her, I find myself thinking about the bars and thinking, oh my God. She's done it again. You can't deny Nikki is an incredible lyricist. Mm -hmm. She takes pride in her work as she should. And she really does constantly switch her flow. Anytime she's featured on a song, it's exciting because you know it's going to be something new and it isn't just her using the same flow. Mm -hmm. Which is a big reason why Nikki has continued to still rain so hard to this very day. It's because she's always doing something new and is always sounding fresh. She didn't lie when she said, I switch it up for every era, I'm really bomb. Number three, chart success. Firstly, songs being number one on the chart doesn't define talent. Yes, it's a great thing, but don't act like it means you have the best song or that the song is great. Mm. People have always slammed Nikki for not having number ones or that her songs don't stay on the chart for very long. Well, let me tell you this. Nikki has only fan support and very little radio play. When Say So went number one, people acted like Nikki and her fans didn't play a part when they did. And when Trolls went number one, it didn't stay for long because it didn't get radio play. Nikki didn't lie when she said all the songs in the top 10 get constant and heavy playlisting, and that's true. How do you expect a song to stay stable on the charts when it's getting no radio play? It's funny because Nikki only has fan support and isn't out here paying DJs to play her song. I'm not being shady to anyone when I say this, but there's been proof that labels promote and push artists so hard to make their songs big. Mm. Funkmaster Flex accused Cardi B of paying DJs to get her music played. Here's what Flex said, let's be clear. Cardi's team and many other artists, in the beginning of careers, pay DJs to play records and say that they are hot. Since I never took a penny from a rapper, I'm not scared to speak on it. I have emails I've gotten from labels over the years with names and figures. No disrespect to Cardi or any other artists, but having obsessive promo and paid stuff is just wrong. The fact that Nicki is blackballed but achieves so much without radio play is incredible. That's called queen shit. Let's just remind ourselves Nicki has two number one hits. 19 top 10s and currently 111 Billboard entries. Two number one albums and two number two albums. Queen shit. Number four. Awards. I'm very proud of every award Nikki has ever won or has been nominated for. She has currently won a total of 268 awards. Queen shit. People always say how is Nicki Minaj the queen of rap when she hasn't won a Grammy. Firstly, you're delusional if you think a Grammy defines a person's talent. <laughs> Secondly, Nicki Minaj doesn't need a Grammy. She has already proven herself to be the best female rapper of all time. And sure, a Grammy would be lovely, but Nicki and millions of people know she doesn't need one. 
People always say Cardi B is the queen of rap because she's got a Grammy and some number ones. Um, Let no. me ask you this. Is Cardi B talented? No. The answer is not really. How can Cardi be the queen of rap when she mumbles and you can hear the spit from her mouth when she raps? Spit. The people who call Cardi the queen call her that because of her number ones and her Grammy. I have never seen anyone talk about how incredible Cardi's lyrics are or how she constantly switches her flow on every song. Mm. The truth is she does neither. And it's disrespectful to Nicki for even comparing her to Cardi when Cardi has yeah. admitted she only wants to make songs that do well on the charts. Because she wants money. The difference between Nicki and Cardi is that rap runs through Nicki's soul and she cares very deeply about her craft. Cardi, however, cares only about the charts and has openly admitted that she doesn't care about being lyrical. How can you be the queen of rap when you don't care about being lyrical? <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, please start looking at a person's talent and skills and not what number their song is on the charts. Number five, final comments. Some people will say that Nicki shouldn't be claiming herself as the queen of rap. But why shouldn't she? When female rap was at the point of extinction. Who kept it going? Nicki started in the game a long time ago. She didn't instantly call herself the queen of rap. It was over time and time when the public and Nicki herself realized the talent. She deserves the title queen of rap because she has the full package. Name another female who can body a beat, out rap males, switch their flow constantly and be lyrical. Name another female who has a clear perfect voice and spits fire bars when they rap. Oh my god, that door. And I'm going to say this again. If you want to call someone the king or queen of something, look at their talent and skills. Not charts and awards. The same with new artists. You cannot instantly call someone who's new in the game the queen just because their songs are doing well. Mm -hmm. That means nothing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rap is about lyrics, remember that. For example, I call Nikki the queen of rap because of her ability. She bodies her tracks, writes her stuff, and is always being a lyrical genius. Also, you can't just say Nikki should pass the title queen of rap to someone else because she's old and there are new hotter artists out right now. I'll tell you this. When you have the skills and the talent that Nicki Minaj has, I may consider giving you that title. Consider. However, your chance is very little, but if you were to get that title, I would give it to you on the 1st of April. Now, before this video ends, let's ask some of the audience who the queen of rap is. Nicki Minaj. Nicki Minaj! Nicki Minaj. 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 I need to know. Okay, so that was it for um his Nicki the Queen rap. Um, I I can't um we have to be fair. Cardi B has not been in rap or in the industry for that long, and Nicki Minaj has. So and Cardi B only has one album. Do I think she is? Oh, uh, what other music? Do y'all think that she? Do I think that she is um fake and um just want money? Yes. Um, mostly everybody does in um music, but um you can't really compare the two. Because Nicki Minaj write all of her stuff and Cardi B doesn't. And Cardi B has a known writer. Like, how do you have a known write writer? So that is it for Nicki Minaj. Is Nicki Minaj, is, is Nicki Minaj the queen of rap? And that's why I'm just saying... The original video will be in the description box below. And please comment what you want me to react to next. And goodbye.